Right now at noon, students across Northeast Florida back in class today as most school districts started the 2022 school year this morning. Buses started rolling out early today before the sun came up. Duval County is now the only district in the area where students are not in class now. Nearly 50,000 kids are back in St. John's County classrooms. News Projects reporter Aaron Farrar checked in with three schools and shows us how this day can be exciting and nerve-wracking. Some of the common sights on the first day of school is look at the long line of traffic, people trying to get into the school here at Creekside High School, drop their students off, as well as figure out what needs to happen throughout the course of the first day. But as we've seen all of this, we've also seen plenty of smiling faces, friends excited to see each other again as they start another school year. All right, you guys can cross. Plenty of joy, anticipation, and lots of traffic to kick off the 2022-2023 school year in St. John's County. New experiences and a new beginning for Selena Laws and her two sons. This is Patrick, who is starting seventh grade at Fruit Cove Middle School. And here's JJ going into his junior year at Creekside High School, both starting new schools and bigger ones at that. And for Patrick, it's his first year riding a bike to school. Oh, that's a big change for him, but I think it's exciting to see all the kids riding. They have an entire parking lot of bikes, so that's new for him. They're both musicians, so they're going to be in band. And so the older one has been doing band camp all week, so that gives him a little chance to adjust. All students in St. John's County have early dismissals today. All middle schoolers get out first at 1250 this afternoon. Most elementary students end their days at 145 this afternoon. And students in high school all around the county, including here at Creekside High, they will be getting out early as well at 2.50 this afternoon. Reporting in St. John's County, I'm Aaron Farrar, Channel 4, the local station. Meantime, students at St. John's County's newest school have a few extra days of summer. Beachside High won't start classes until Monday. Its first day was delayed because of construction. In fact, we got a first look inside earlier this week. The school will serve students in northern St. John's County and help alleviate overcrowding at nearby schools.